Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to use this brand new knife and scissors tool in Affinity Designer version 2. So they recently add this very requested tool into a new version of Affinity Designer. So let's take a look. On the left side in your regular tool panel now we can see a proper knife tool. So let's explore that. Select the knife tool and take a look. I cannot use it without selecting a shape. So I need to select a shape first. Let's zoom a little bit. I using command plus to zoom in. And now I can just click and start drawing this line across the shape. Let's move outside the shape, release. And here it is. We just split the shape into two separate shapes that fully vector shapes we can rotate this one it's just pure vector nothing's on it if i select no tool i will be able to see all the nodes i can even move them around delete them or modify them so that's really a clean tool that will split any vector shape into two or more let's try to use it once more again knife tool and this time i will smooth my line let's turn on this option here and this will make your line much smoother we will stabilize the line so it's a little bit better i would say it depends what kind of result you want if you want a harsh line don't use that if you need the smooth one turn on this little checkbox here let's switch it off try again without it so a little bit rougher here all right as you can see i can cut this one shape multiple times now i got three separate shapes out of it let's use knife tool this time i will turn on auto close so in case you didn't move to the end like you release like halfway through it will auto close your cut so it will go back to the beginning kind of and you can pull this out this way so normally with knife with knife tool you should like go across the shape but with that option you don't need to all right so where is the scissor tool we cannot see scissors in the tool panel because it's kind of hidden inside the knife itself so if you use the knife tool and hover above a stroke a line a border like this you will got the scissor take a look just hover and we got scissor tool if you click one time, you make a cut and now you can move one side of this line out. So we just cut the curve. We cut this stroke here, the line with the scissor. We can cut here as well. And then with the node tool, we can select the middle part and hit delete. And it's gone. So we make two cuts with the scissor and then we delete this middle part. That's really, really handy. That was missing in the previous version of Affinity Designer. So to use a scissor tool, just simply select knife tool, hover your mouse above the line, and then you simply do one click to make a cut with the scissors. Later on, you can use no tool to move those freshly cutted lines around as you please you see we got multiple separate lines now out of this one shape all right so that's it now finally we got a knife tool and scissors tool and luckily they are really straightforward easy to use tools i hope this was helpful stay tuned for more videos from the new version of affinity software see you in the next one